monsters. Kazra says the platforming issue was they changing the gravity in his jump arc and they changed Crash's hitbox but didn't adjust the platforming for the new shape. If I'm also remembering correctly, oh, damn it. they also uh, rounded the geography of stuff. Like, uh, I think there's three main issues, like the gravity, because like an actual jumping problem, then the Crash's hitbox, which uh, reminded me, I'm pretty certain there was a thing of somebody theorizing that when they remade the Crash games, they didn't uh, go and uh, readjust the geog. Like, actually, they did go and readjust the geography. So, like, uh, back in the day when it was like, oh, it's all blocky. The platforming is all blocks. It's super simple. But then they made, like, circular ones, and then you, like, slide off. Oh, and then, let me just check because I missed the oh, 100. Yay, 100! I'm also pretty sure that in the Insane Trilogy, they also forgot to add in, uh, I forget what it's called. But basically, it's a principle in platforming where even if a player is, uh, like a step off of a ledge, you still have a jump. So, like, if a player stepped off a ledge, they'd be able to jump, but if they, they didn't press jump, they'd fall, because it just feels more natural to be like, I want to optimize my my ability to fly and stuff, like, to jump off of a ledge, so I will wait until the last second. And they just didn't include that. So some problems with uh, dear old crash but so far because Spyro is much more casual much more casual and that's not a bad thing crash is difficult and uh, unforgiving but Spyro is just fun that's what I love about it Spyro is just a fun experience let's take a look at these dudes huh I always imagine them to be birds. They don't really look like birds to me here. Weird. Not a bad design choice, just not the one I would have gone with. Though that does mean I do not know what they actually are. I guess that was kind of a bird chicken person. I like it. I like. I like it. I like it a lot. This is just this is doing for me everything. This is just so good. Not to mention I just love the style here. The style here is so good. Like my god. This is wonderful. This is my aesthetic. It's detailed, but cartoony. Mm. Hello, Halvor. How are you? How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't work on metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. Hey, get over here. Get over here. Get back here. I'm after you. Yeah, the greedy little man. The greedy little man. The greedy little man. Dang it. Maybe if I ran around the other way. Take that, jerk. Yes, indeed, Kazrod. This is Tom Kinney voicing uh, Spiral the Dragon. In fact, it's technically reprising his app. Ah, I got I got sorted. Ow. I I always imagined those to just be large knives, but okay. Cuz while uh, Tom Kenny wasn't the original voice actor for Spyro, like Tom Kenny didn't voice him in Spyro 1, he did voice him in Spyro 2 and 3. Which is just super cool. Get out of here. No shanking today. No shanks. 
not shank you. Well, I shank you, you don't shank me. Yeah, these definitely don't look anything like I imagined, but not bad. It just kind of looks like they gave them beaks in the original. Which I don't know why. Yes, indeed, Tom Kenny is a top tier voice actor. I'm not sure that would actually protect you any, but okay. I'm going to have this metal cape. It'll protect me from heat. Sure it will. <laughs> sure it will. Can you feel it now, Mr. Krabs? We have to do. We, ha we had to. I, I like it. Just, I like it. Just the claps. I like it. So good. So nice. I like it. Enzo. Hey, I love the redesigns. What's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? We can actually see. Please make it. No. <laughs> Yeah, it seems like they did round the geography here as well. Oh, well. My pain! My pain! But I'll still have fun, because it's Spyro, dang it! And I love Spyro! You can't make me hate him! You can gremlin a him all you like! Because, like, over all the years of me not playing Skylanders games, the gremlin-looking Spyro design has kind of grown on me, oddly enough. I still prefer this Spyro look over- Oh, no, 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 no. Like, I don't know. There's something about the, uh, the original, like, gremlin Spyro design that has something to it, or at least the new one. I'm not sure if they've updated it any, but the- like, the gremlinish Spyro in the Skylanders Netflix series looks decent. Doesn't look terrible. Looks nice. <laughs> birds of a feather. Kill all the birds in this level. Because, like, uh, he at least looks a bit better than... Because I've always... Eh. Like, uh, I'll, I'll ramble after this. You've reached the highest point in Clifftown. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, I'd use that whirlwind over there. I really feel like I've heard some of these voice actors before. You made it to the tiest place in Clifftown. I can't do a voice like that, kind of. I'm not even sure what I'd call that voice. Distinct is what I'd call it. Like, I, it's, I feel like I've heard it! Oh, thank you. I almost fell off and died. Hmm. Pain and misery. Let's fly. I'm trying to think. I had a thing to, I had a thing to say. Oh yeah, because there's actually a bit of like the uh, the Legend of Spyro design. At least for the last game, I had a had a bit of a umbrage with. Not umbrage, just like, and eh, it doesn't. It looks weird. I get it. You're trying to be like Spyro. He's grown up a bit. Looks a bit weird. <laughs> grown up a bit. To be a bit weird. Not bad, just... This will forever be my optimal, like, Spyro. To me. Did I miss something? Ah. I know though! Damn it. I am a fool! I am a fool! Luckily, here's a whirlwind that's gonna take us back up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, da da da, da da da. I'm gonna miss that because I didn't fly directly to it. Blah 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 blah. <laughs> Let's fly. What? Light it up. Uh, do I have to actually land there? Ah, uh, it's a tall order. But I'll do it. 
I will do it so that I can claim my honor as a fireworks lighter aficionado. Oh, I feel like I am a double fool. I'm not supposed to do it from there. I'm supposed to do it from up there. Blah, 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 blah. blah what a fool. Reminds me, isn't there? I knew those little rascals were there. Because I remember the last time I played this, I was uh, two, like a few gyms off. I was like, where are those gyms? It's like, oh, I have been bamboozled by gyms. But no holograms. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Nice. Let's apply to the sky, but not die. Give me all the gems. I just love this. I just love it so much. I'm, that's gonna be like 90% of my stinking commentary. It's like, it's so good. I love it. It's nice and beautiful. Ah, uh, no. I'm still missing gems. No. Even after all this time, I am bamboozled by myself. Once more, my memory. It has failed me! <laughs> I am a fool. But that just means I get to enjoy the geography some more! And there is nothing wrong with admiring this freaking game. I see the gems in the distance. The ones that have... Of, of miss well one oh it's a it's a double I forgot greens too hmm. I just love it so much it's so good this just hits all the right spots so far it's kind of like how night in the woods is just like this is a gr this is how you do a not gameplay heavy game with wonderful characters. This is like how you do a remake. Like, I know a lot of people had, well, a lot of people, but there was a decent amount of people like, ah, the Norks don't look like I'd imagine them. Oh, the, uh, those there people. Da, 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 da. And then the people doing side by sides, like, they changed the design of the castle in the second artisan home w world. Blue. Like, I'm not that much of a stickler. It's kind of like, uh. I don't know. I guess after. <laughs> they do! Oh! They do! They do moon you! Oh my god! How? <laughs> they, they do! <laughs> they do! Oh my god! I did not expect that! Because in the original, when you burn down the little huts, they automatically do it. With this one, I guess it goes through a cycle of cowering and then mooning. My god! They actually did it! The mad... The madmen actually did it! My god! Oh, I love it. I love it. I love. It's just so good. I love it. Oh, this game. This game. My eternal praise for every last person who worked on this game. It's so good. It's so good. Just my god, this is what I love. Seeing an old school, wonderful character, not reimagined, but like, kind of fully realized like once again people are gonna be like oh they changed the designs I don't think so I don't think they changed the design so much as expanded with the dragons they expanded with the norks 
I think they just fully realize. Because there's only so much you can really show off with PlayStation 1 graphics. The bats had me scared for a moment. <laughs> the bats actually had me scared for a moment. Word of caution, little one. Wait until you grow big, <clears throat> like me, before charging those large enemies. Man, I feel like he could have uh, done with some large horns. Because he's the he's a chargey dude. I charge those dudes. Like he could uh, he could have done with uh Then again, sword shield, but nah, I don't know. <laughs> it's still a good design. It just made like once again, at most, I can't bring myself to say it's like, nah, it's bad. It's like, because it's not. It's good. It's nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. I don't even know where I heard that sound clip. I don't even know what it's from or where I heard it, because I heard it in an internet, like, video, so I'm not even sure if that's the original. <laughs> Big Norks up ahead are wearing armor, and in the ice cave, armor can make their feet very slippery. Hmm. The designs, the aesthetics, it's all so good. My eternal love. Ooh, nice. You just have to get a glancing hit. And yes, indeed. The level aesthetics are so good. Just love it. Nice! I love it! The armor looks so good and detailed. There is something highly amusing to the really silly looking plate armor, but this is just so good. I love it. I love it so much. This is... Man, this was... Spiral wasn't even my childhood, but this just exudes, like, feelings of childhoodness and awesome. Hello, Andor. Thank you for releasing me. Like, even the thank you for releasing me, dragons are getting... Ah! I miss! at me! How dare you! I kill you! Oh, this game is so... Oh, God! It just fuels my aesthetic! Just the texturing, the design, I love! Ah! How dare you throw snow at me! Don't you know? I am Icy Wings! You cannot hurt me with snow and ice! You fool! Thank you for volunteering as tribute, dear bat. Like, honestly, the actual platforming platforming is much better than I remember. It's just the gliding is a bit wonky. <laughs> Which, honestly, I don't mind too much. Too much, too much. Get out of here! Get out of here! Boom! Love it! They love it! This is just lovely. Like, honestly, this is the type of game that I would play through just to experience the world. Because it looks so damn good! Yeah, keep throwing those snowballs, sucker! I'm coming for you! Hey, you get back here! You don't just see me and turn around! Hey, I wonder what that means. No. Get out of here. You think you can topple me? No! For I am the Icy Wing! You cannot kill me! With ice? No! 